it was less that there was something missing and more that I knew there was something more I wanted to do. Um, after having spent 30 years traveling all over the world, I didn't know very much about my own backyard, so this is my chance to really get to know what's going on here. And this process is a transition, not a transaction. You don't wake up one day and decide that you're going to turn the switch and now all of a sudden you're going to have an encore career. Um, use the resources that are out there that already exist. Um, get as involved as you can in volunteering because you'll learn a ton through that process about what you like and don't like, and what you're good and what you're not so good at. Most of us want to keep working productively for as long as we can do that. And working productively could be continue in the private sector, but for a lot of us we want to give things back. We want to explore new, new areas and opportunities. So there are roughly 40 to 45 million baby boomers who not only want to keep working but want to work in social purpose high social value jobs. And even if only 10% or 20% of that 40 or 45 million actually make this shift, that's 8 million, 10 million, pick a number, people who are actually now going to, in one way or another, um, participate in, in nonprofits and social purpose work and have to have a huge impact on what happens going forward.